Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. Hope you had a beautiful Easter weekend and we're still on the same piece, um, an extension from last time, of ways to speak positively or differently that are going to make an impact for your child's life. So what I was um, wanting to work with today is teaching children to speak positively about themselves. Now why I'm on about this is that I've noticed so often that we as adults, when we don't speak positively about ourselves, and we criticize ourselves, put ourselves down, we seem to be quite surprised when our kids do the same thing, or we worry about their self-esteem in terms of how they are depreciating themselves. So the top tip for this week is to teach children to positive self-talk. One of the things we do with our NGO is a little saying, I am magical, I am magnificent, and I am amazing. We call it MMA, magical, magnificent, and amazing. Now, of course, not all kids are going to believe that, and it's a lot of inner work to get them to change their perceptions. But when you start talking positively yourself, it's going to rub off on them. So give it a go, and maybe you can even have a little encouragement jar, a jar somewhere in the kitchen that whenever you hear them saying good words about themselves, it goes into the jar. Or not even good words about themselves, but good words, positive words about each other. So we, we actually, in terms of nonviolent communication, we're looking to create a world, I believe, or I would love to have. We're looking to create a world where even our words are nonviolent. Even our words are compassionate and caring, and our words help us. Our words are really, really potent, and our words can help us help build a child up. They can help destroy a child. Uh, we know this very much from our own lives. So you might want to think back to your own life too and which words that people use on you that have still haven't had an impact. Everything can be changed around. So go ahead and give it a try. That's the one top tip is teaching them to speak positively about themselves and others. Another one I wanted to give you is to remember eye contact. When you look children in the eye and go down to their level, especially younger ones, it makes a very much very big impact in terms of them being seen, felt and heard. So give these tips a try. Remember to comment, like and share. And also guys, if you are interested in some of our new easy online parenting courses, which happen once the kids are in bed, please do leave your email and you'll be going onto our database to receive the info. Have a beautiful MMA, magical, magnificent and amazing day.